So in this video, we're going to be using NVIDIA's audio to face add-on based off a video that I created, how sick is that, to rig this character's face. How does that make you feel? Very good. <laughs> <laughs> so there's three things that you need to rig a character's face very quickly. One of them is Omniverse, and this is what we're looking at at the moment. And once you're in Omniverse in the library, we need audio to face. We need their version of Blender. Oh, and actually, that's, that's, that's pretty much it. Click on Blender. Let's go launch and install if you haven't already. And let's get right into it. Select everything, delete. What I'm going to do is bring in my character. And here's our character from Battletoads, for those of you who remember playing the NES, one of the hardest games ever made. Now, how to check that you're in the right version. If you look in the side panel here, you should have an Omniverse add-on. This is the default one. This is the audio to face one, which we will be looking at. One of the most important things you have to remember is select the rig and we need to reset the pose. So let's come up here into object mode, change this to pose mode. Make sure we've got everything selected by double tapping A, Alt R to reset the rotation, Alt G to reset the location and Alt S to reset the scale, just in case we have to. Back into object mode. Now let's select the mesh. Now we wanna look at the mesh that we wanna affect. Um, let's go into edit mode and I'm going to just chop off his head. I just want that loop there. That's about right. So this is what we want to focus on. So now let's go ahead and quickly select everything that we want uh, to rig. Like so. There we go. We've got everything selected on the body mesh use face selection. This is going to be export dynamic now. Now I need to get the eyeballs as well. So if I increase the properties panel, we can see that we've got outer and inner. This is just part of the mesh. I'm just going to delete the outer and we're just going to work with the inner, but I will separate these two now. So let's go into edit mode, select this side, control L to select everything that's linked P to separate by selection. With this eye, this eye is going to be called I.L. This one here will be I dot err. Now we can come into edit mode, select all the mesh and export as static and select the other eye tab, select all export static. And now we can see here that we've got an eye left and an eye right under the statics and under the body, we've got dynamic. So skin, left eye and the right eye. Now, because this chap doesn't have a tongue, doesn't have a lower gums or kind of like a lower teeth that move with the bottom of the mouth. I don't have to do anything with that. But if you did have them, you would follow the same process. From here, let's go export the path. I'm just going to call this one a BT underscore face. And we will choose that USD. And let's go export audio to face USD. Brilliant. Now I've noticed that I've stuffed something up here. If I click on the armature, I can see I left two keyframes on there like a donkey. So let's just quickly go into pose mode, select that. Let's delete these keyframes in the bottom left. Alt R, Alt G, Alt S, just to put everything back in location. Now let's jump over into audio to face. Now it might've opened up with a face already. I start off with a new file by going file, new. Let's start from scratch. From here up into the character transfer tab, Let's find our face, uh, BT face that we just created and I'm going to dump it into the uh, stage. I can press F to zoom in and let's just kind of rotate this chap around. If we increase the stage, we can see all our meshes that we created. Lovely. So let's expand our character setup. Let's select our skin mesh, which will be this one plus. And now we've got to tell which way is forward and up. So up is correct. I think forward on this character is minus X. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. From here, we've got no gums or teeth. We've got no tongue. So that goes back to what we were talking about earlier about if you've got lower teeth or stuff inside the mouth, that's the mesh you want to put in. The tongue is obviously the tongue. Left eye. So let's go ahead and select our left eye, I.L. So these here are X forms, which are pretty much empties in Blender. We will click on that one. And for the right eye, let's go plus, lovely. From here, I'm gonna click on set up character. We don't have gum or teeth and tongue. Yes, I would like to proceed. 
and now we've brought in these two wonderful chaps now this one here is going to be our best friend and now we need to like hook these two up so from here we go into add mode and i'm going to start off by selecting the corner eye and the corner eye so what we are doing is linking these meshes together so we know that that one is there top of the eye is here bottom of the eye is here and then we can do kind of like the start of the eyebrow middle of the eyebrow and end of the eyebrow and we will go ahead and do that for the whole face so let me just quickly fast forward and there you can kind of see all these dots and all their relationships now obviously the more dots you put in the better the quality and if we need to move some we just go mm, done adding edit mode that one there sir go over there yeah there we go that's good enough <laughs> done editing from here we can click now begin mesh fitting and it's going to do all the calculations for transferring shape keys and so on and so forth cool the mesh is gone that's fine now we come down into begin post wrap and that brings him back no jaw no tongue so we can skip all this jazz from here i'm going to go blend shape transfer and so it's going to create all our blend shapes sweet and now i can go export as usd from here let's go bt underscore lead done and we'll save that beautiful jumping back into blender i'm now going to select our uh, Ladun USD scale. Okay. So let's double click on that one. And then we're going to click import rig file. Excellent. From here, what I can do is now I just go transfer shape data. Transferred 46 shapes down the bottom. That sounds fantastic. Let's now untick audio to face. We've gone back to our character. Now with the body selected, we can come down into our shape keys and we have, hello there. How did I do by rigging this face? Ha 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 ha. 